it's your turn. Hey guys, it's Esco Question Four here back again with a new video for you guys. And today I'm doing a special hunting video at Chinatown, New York City. So I'm gonna be looking for some Dragon Ball goodies, whether it's a bootleg, which probably will be the case, or official stuff. But I'm excited to show you all what they got ever since um, COVID because I haven't been to Chinatown since probably late 2019. So, all right. Let's go and check it out. There we go. Very, it looks very different from the last time I was at Chinatown. They set some places up so you can sit outside and eat. So that's pretty cool. Very clever. All right, this is the first place we're gonna check out. I saw some Dragon Ball bootlegs from the window while we were passing by. Ooh, look at all the Sonic ones they got. Sonic, Super Mario Brothers. Oh, the bootleg uh, Funko Pop. Look at the Super Sonic. And then of course they got Dragon Ball. I like these in the back. <laughs> the super collection. I need to take a closer look at them. And they got these smaller ones. Ooh. Very cool. I've never seen these before. awesome cute <laughs> sonic bootlegs and it has um the sonic movie logo on it and everything and even the old artwork of sonic <laughs> that's funny love these yes. oh, nice. yes thank you okay i appreciate it All right, so this is the mall and then like the center. I don't know if it's open, but let's see. <laughs> it's the one that I usually go to. This is Elizabeth Center. Uh-huh, see? Chloe's got stuff over here. Little keychains here and there. So we're going down now. Let's see what they got here. This used to be an anime shop. Gone. It's gone now. That was all clothing, but it was anime at one point. This is one of the shops. Oh, Tanjiro. I got this. This is cool. Check that out. See what else they got. <laughs> I remember these plushies used to be real cheap, now they're more expensive. <laughs> Nezuko. Oh cool, here's another one. Goku. Some more stuff. Yamcha. I like the cumber actually. It looks cool. They have this wallet too, Goku wallet. What else? The one have in there. Tanjiro. More. Dragon Ball figures. Whoa, what is this supposed to be? Broly. <laughs> Super Saiyan 4 5? I don't know. And <laughs> My. 
I got this other hybrid of a character. Funny bootlegs. Okay. Got some more over here. Got some Pokemon stuff back there. And then these guys, Goku, Black Rose, and Goku crouching down. Gohan. Look at a Nezuko figure there. <laughs> Oh, I like those, like old school looking Pokemon keychains. It's cute. There's more down here. Oh, look at that Vegeta. Adverge bootlegs, by the way, and some WCS ones. Okay. Oh, look at this sticker sheet. 18 different pieces. This store didn't really have too much except what you saw on the window there, so I didn't film inside, but no, those are legit. So check out this one. This one has some legitimate Dragon Ball figures. Got these. And the entry, entry grade Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku, and Vegeta. Those are cool. We also got, oh look, ooh, Japan bottle t-shirt. That's awesome that they have that huh i don't know how much those are it's a t-shirt in there <laughs> something <laughs> yeah oh yeah these two tokyo osaka that's awesome and they got a nezuko one too the demon slayer and then we have these sh figures of course they're always super nice to look at they're great figures yeah, I have this. This is a great Ape Vegeta figure arts they got. They got this one too. And then some Adverge figures. And then look, Demon Slayer. It's really cool. Look at this, very cool. Not bad. Look at all the model kits. Figureized model kits. Very nice. Uh huh. That's not bad. Got these as well. Ooh. <laughs> I might. I probably will get this actually. <laughs> the Frieza X Materia. GX Materia, sorry. <laughs> I need this. That's a good price for him. We got these as well. And these up top. Ooh, look at this. They also got... Hmm, looks like a little blanket thing. See this? A Gogeta. I think it's a little... I don't know what it is. I think it's a mini blanket. Not sure. And they got A. Hello. Check out the pillow. Cute. And I got this too. I don't know what this is. Let's see. I'm assuming. Ah, okay. So I'm assuming this went inside this. <laughs> That's what I think. 
I got the Imagination Works Goku up there too. Cool. More stuff here. Oh, these are the shirts. Cool. Nice. Good selection here for your um, figure art needs. Oh. Nice. GTWCF figures. Oh, Nova. Nova. Got these two. Dragon Ball. Art. Look at the Nezuko. That's adorable. <laughs> Nezuko. Look at this Nezuko. Really cute. And this one too. <laughs> Can't go wrong with Nezuko, right? We got these two. Look at these. We have a bunch of WCF figures here. And Adverge ones too. And yeah, the chibi ones. <laughs> I'm impressed by the selection that they got. Oh, look at the Tanjiro. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. And also in SK. Hmm, they do not have. Zenitsu, my favorite. They don't have Zenitsu. And this dude is a crazy guy. <laughs> Tengen. Yeah, there's a lot to see. Not just Dragon Ball, of course, but there's a wide variety of many animes. Check this out. Ooh. Oh yeah, the whole set. And figure arts here. Very nice. And these here, accessories. These as well. I can attest this is a good figure. <laughs> Very cool. Like I said, this is a good store for anything like high quality figures <laughs> definitely high quality figures here very nice go to the elizabeth center mall for this store in chinatown so in case you're wondering this is a store that i was at um here's their socials if you want to follow them they're called sanrio hello kitty but it's not just hello kitty it's a lot of other stuff like you saw um lots of dragon ball so check it out Alright, next up, we're going to Dash Corp. Woo! <laughs> my gosh. Okay, you know, it's aggressive here in New York. <laughs> um, Dash Corp always go to this place. So, it says open. Let's check it out. These are so cool, I love these figures. See, this is the other one in the set. See? I already have that one, so. <laughs> oh yeah, I know. Very cool. Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball. Got pops too. There's stuff in every nook and cranny, clearly, as you can see. Model kits. Piggy Rise model kits. Nice. Dragon Ball. Very cool. I got these too. My Hero Academia. <laughs> I still have not seen that uh, Mew Pop that I've been looking for. Board game. <laughs> 
is the one we saw before, yeah? Yeah. 40. I think it was 42. I don't know. I don't know if this one is 42. That's cool though. All right, guys, so that was it for uh, Chinatown. So now I'm on my way to Midtown Comics, which is in the city. Um, really by Times Square, honestly. So we're on our way to that to see some Dragon Ball items at Midtown Comics. So, all right, let's get going. All right, y'all, so we're here at Midtown Comics. One of my favorite stores to go to. I love the smell of comic books. That's what this place smells like. Let's see what they got. Oh, More WCF figures. Average. Today, mangas are on sale, 25% off. <laughs> Gotta check out the manga, to be honest. Manga. I always see this Goku everywhere in every store I've been to. So far. <laughs> Almost. Most of them, at least. Dragon Ball. Hey. Some more imagination works. Goku again in the store. We got this one. Ichiban Show. Goku. We got some Dragon Stars too. Actually, I don't have this. <laughs> I got Krillin too. Piggy Warts. These as well. Very cool. I do have this Goku though. Nice. So we're going up. Second floor. Check that out. Goku standy. You go over here. There it is. Goku. Nice. What else they got over here? Huh. I oh, don't see Dragon Ball stuff. <laughs> Nothing here. Statues. No Dragon Ball. Wow, this used to be the floor for Dragon Ball stuff. I don't see anything now. <laughs> That's crazy. What the hell? What happened to all the Dragon Ball shit? <laughs> Unless they moved it to the other location or something. Wow. I'm shocked. Literally shocked. There's nothing. <laughs> they have these. More Ichiban Shogokus. I guess that section that I saw downstairs was it. That's crazy. Damn. Nothing. <laughs> what a letdown. What a letdown. <laughs> that sucks. Damn, remember the other times I've come here? They have like a whole display. That sucks. 
Oh well. Well, now y'all know that there isn't Dragon Ball stuff here. This is the only other thing I found, a hip plush right here. Um, not too much else. Just hit Ichiban show um, figures you saw there and whatever I showed downstairs. Wow. Like I said, maybe all the other stuff is in the other location. Who knows? Maybe they switch stuff over. I have no clue. That sucks. All right, so that, that was it for um, this Midtown Comics location. I did get volume 13 of Dragon Ball Super. Um, but we shall see. Next stop is um, Book Off. Book Off in NYC. Maybe we can find some good manga there too. Or video games. Or, or toys. Let's go. All right, here's Book Off. We're here at the NYC location. I've been to the one in Japan before in Tokyo and now here is NYC Book Off. Let's go. See what they got in here. Nice. Anime stuff here. Oh, cool. Mighty. Armadillo. <laughs> Sonic. They have a huge variety of toys here, clearly, as you can see. Huge variety. I got Vegeta. I got a bunch of old, even Japanese video games. Here's the Game Boy. And they got a... Classic vintage Dragon Ball game there. Oh wow, Pokemon Pinball in Japanese. That's cool. <laughs> That's really cool. This one here is only $15.99. This one what? Game Boy. Oh wow, look at Pokemon Green version. Wow, Japanese. They got Pokemon Blue, Yellow, Red, and Green. That's really cool. Uh, DBZ here too. Right there. Oh, look at all these. Oh, here we go. One more. Hey. Got the Super Famicom. That's awesome. Which is Super Nintendo in America, of course. Lots of Japanese games. That's awesome. You don't see that every day. Check this out. This is a bootleg big time though. But yeah. <laughs> Trying to find whatever they got for Dragon Ball. That's a major bootleg. This one is not though. Okay, so there's that. Um, what else? Uh, I don't know. Not too many yet. I haven't seen too many Dragon Ball items. What's up with that? <laughs> I found this, a VWFC uh, chrome color freaking Vegeta, there's that, $40 and no thanks. Check these out too, they're way, I mean the freaking, some of these are way overpriced here, sorry, just gotta point that out real fast, but yeah, they got these as well here in Book Off. Check out all of these, SH Figuarts, Dragon Ball stuff, that's cool. I like how they have the big wide variety selection of these. Oh, wow, they got this Vegeta too, and they got this Frieza too. I need that Frieza, but I don't have the money right now to spend on that. And yeah, so more figures here. Check that out. Dragon Ball Z. More things here. Very cool. And more figures. And Dragon Stars. A lot of cool stuff here. You know, some of them are a little bit expensive, just letting you know. Lucky a little bit expensive, yeah. <laughs> like, check this out. This uh, Vegeta Dragon Stars is way too expensive, in my opinion. $45 for this. All right, and it's used to pre owned. Uh uh, no thanks. Here's some Dragon Ball DVDs here. Um, the orange bricks, of course, and some more single ones there. Like the, these classic ones. I only had like three, four episodes. And each DVD. <laughs> How cool they have the history of Trunks one. That's cool. 
$30. $30? Dang. <laughs> oh, I love like the, the artwork though. I know they're like screen caps from the show, but I do like them on the cover. Let's see, how much is this? Oh, that's cheap. $16. <laughs> What's DVD? They got GT ones too. Oh, they got the Steelbook ones. Wow. Makes sense that it's expensive because the Steelbook ones are actually fairly hard to find. Um, got the box set here. Wow, $90. It's too much. <laughs> too much. Too much in my opinion. And let's see how much one of these is. One of these? Okay, $13. That's reasonable. So yeah, there you go. Okay, so now this leads to the downstairs basement that has the manga and anime. Oh, I like that wall scroll. Yu Yu Hakusho. Here is the manga, Dragon Ball manga. They have Dr. Slump over there if you see that. Check that out. They have a pretty good selection of manga, but they're honestly full price. They're not like discounted or anything, which is the only lame thing about it, but they do have a very good selection of manga and just different series as well. Many different other series that you can um, see that you might like. See? Very, very, very large selection. It's expensive, bro. Expensive as fuck. Like that, it's really expensive. That's hell. Alright. Alright, that's it. That's it for a book off. Let's get out of well, here. I get it back for 80 cents. The book was a dollar. Wait, what? No way. Did they ask that? Bag for 80 cents. 80 cents. Wow, 80 I cents. love this Bag poster. Can cents. I buy this poster? Just kidding. <laughs> what the hell? Anyways, let's get out of here. Alright, y'all. Here we go. The Comics. See what they got in here. This is the second location to the Town Comics. Let's check up here. See if they got Dragon Ball stuff. Let's go. If not, I'll be very disappointed. Look at this. Check this out. Brand new Monopoly. Dragon Ball Super. There you go. They have a lot of statues here. Nice. If you're into comics, guys, there you go. Lots of really neat, detailed statues for you. Check that out. Super cool. Check this out. Dragon Stars. Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. We got 18. Then we got Bardock. Looks awesome. I got these two. Final Blast series figures. These as well. Again, Imagination Works Goku. I keep seeing that guy all over the place. Got these. I'm actually missing the Super Saiyan Goku one. More figures, Ben Presto figures. I love this. I love uh, Gogeta in his base form. He looks awesome. I have this. I do have this. this. is a very nice Gohan. Model kit. See, I believe this is a model kit of some sort. I think so. More model kits here. Uh, figure eyes model kits. Both bags were in uh, this one here. And then also, check out more figure arts. That's awesome that, that they have the MG figure eyes. Super Saiyan Goku. That's the older model kit figure up there. Limit Breaker Super Saiyan Goku. 
They have um, a new series of those coming out soon. I think it was Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, Perfect Cell, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, and I believe a Gogeta. And also this. Tamashi Buddies Frieza. Hey, the full color Saiyan Saga, and they got Frieza Saga too. These are beautiful, by the way. I've seen them before. They are gorgeous in color. More manga. Yamcha. This is really funny, by the way. If you guys haven't read this, it's worth a read. <laughs> The time I got reincarnated as Yamcha. It's a funny little short story. We got a few super mangas as well. I don't know why people still carry this event calendar because it's way past Christmas. Wasn't that made for Christmas time? I don't know. <laughs> but I must say there is more Dragon Ball stuff in general in this location rather than the one in the city, like, you know, Times Square. Check that out. Pops. Dragon Ball Pops. Yay. They got some shirts too. Anime shirts. Look, they got Red Ribbon. Army t-shirt. It's kind of cool. And then they also got a Badman Vegeta shirt. Look. <laughs> Badman. <laughs> That's always funny. Oh, they got Frieza too. Look at that. Nice. Naruto. Uh, yeah, a good variety of anime t-shirts, that's for sure. Nice. Hey guys, this is Goshen here and I'm back from my trip to Chinatown and New York City. And I wanna show you what I got. Uh, a few things here that I picked up. Okay, the first thing that I got from Chinatown was this Dragon Ball Super or whatever Resurrection Ev, <laughs> a large Goku bootleg figure, it says Super Collection, and it looks like he lights up in the middle here. There's his face. I mean, it looks all right. It looks like his neck can like come off at any minute, but, <laughs> and it comes with like some Dragon Balls here. I thought this was a pretty cool bootleg figure. It's um a large size as well there's the back of it it was 25 bucks uh, maybe a little expensive for a bootleg but i mean whatever it's a larger size one too and i'm okay with that so okay interesting bootleg now um to add to my collection i also got this from chinatown the gx materia death ball frieza and he looks badass. I I think I'm missing one more figure from the Jake's Material line, um, but I always was fond of these because I like the energy attacks that they come with. So there's that, 25 bucks. And then lastly, I got this Dragon Ball Super Volume 13 manga with a moto there. Just came out, I think. It's brand new. Got it for. 25% off, so it was like eight bucks about. Not bad, not bad. Um, like a dollar, uh, well, two dollars off from the original price. So that's my little haul from New York City and Chinatown. <laughs> so yeah, guys, that was my little haul. Um, you know, I love going down to the city. Uh, Chinatown is awesome. Always great for bootleg goodies. If you're into bootlegs, you know, Chinatown is the spot for that. Like I said in the video, I recommend Elizabeth Center, which is like a little mall in Chinatown. And of course, just any of the shops you see down the, the street um, is worth going into. You never know what they can have. And then I went to Midtown Comics, and I'll put the address in the description there for Midtown. And it's worth going to the different locations that Midtown Comics has. They have a few throughout New York, but um, I just went to two locations. I'll put the addresses in the description below. So, all right, guys, hope you enjoyed this hunting video. And until next time, peace out, Goshen Force. Remember to keep breaking limits every single day. Hey.
Hey, it's Pan from Dragon Ball GT, and you're watching my good friend SSJ Goshen 4. Peace!